First, we're gonna remove the two 10 millimeter bolts on each side. There's one here and one here. Next, we're gonna remove two five millimeter Allen's. It's gonna be one, two, After that, you're gonna remove 11 plastic push tabs. So be careful, try not to damage the tabs. By using a panel popper, you could pop them out. Okay, so now that you're done with the bottom, let's uh, start with the sides. Now you're gonna remove three Phillips screws. There's one, two, and three. Open up the wheel well and to the back. So you can see this piece right here. You just have to press down and it will release. And then you could just remove the, the light bulb. Alright, now to pop the bumper off, you could, uh, from the side here, there's a tab right here. You could just push down and release. Now that we're done with the bottom and the sides, we can pop the hood and start with the top. All right, before we get started on removing this uh, radiator shroud, I'm gonna give you a little tip on removing these clips right here. Um, best thing to use is a flat head, a small one. And there's a dark spot right here for it to uh, stick in. And then you just wiggle it out. You know, pop off a lot easier than using the panel popper so you don't okay so we have one two three four five six seven eight nine tabs that are securing the radiator radiator shroud and with these tabs since I already popped all of them um, you can just remove it with your hand So now that I removed the plastic tabs, you can uh, lift this thing off and remove it. Now we're gonna we're going to remove the weather strip. Um, there's one uh, tab just like the radiator shroud, and you're gonna remove that one. And then there's one, two, three, four clips. Go ahead and pop those out. So after you move the, remove the weather strip, there's, uh, there's these two holes on the top of this uh, bumper piece above the headlight. And inside, there's a black plastic tab you just wanna press down on the tab and it'll release. Okay. Now to release the, the bumper below the headlight, there's these, there's two tabs, there's one here and one here. You just want to release it. So after you mask the headlight, you can, uh, you can unplug the fog light on both sides. So we had four plugs connected to the OEM headlight. There's one, two, three, 
two, three, and four. And after you unplug the bulbs, um, there's one, two clips that are connected to the top of the headlight and you just have to remove them. So now we're gonna transfer over the bottom bracket from the OEM to the, to the spider headlight. So just flip your OEM upside down and unbolt these two 10 millimeter bolts. it to the car. Go ahead and plug in your harnesses. mount the bumper, go ahead and uh, plug the fog lights back in. Carefully mount the bumper. Go ahead and uh, mount your weather strip back on. Line it up. Install your radiator shroud. Go ahead and close your hood. Plug in your side marker harness. Line up your wheel well and screw back into place. Go ahead and put your 10 millimeter bolts back in. Now your installation is complete, go ahead and take off the masking tape and test out the functions. 